In this video, we're going to take a look at what makes Phantom such a great performance instrument. As a keyboard player, you need a great keyboard and Phantom delivers. The new models have a brand new design that are quick and responsive and feel great to play. We have a brand new keyboard on the six and the seven models that includes Aftertouch. It's fluid and quick and just a wonder to play. And then on the 88 model, we have the PHA50, a very highly respected keyboard that has escapement and feels exactly like playing a grand piano. Phantom is built to last, made of sturdy metals and is designed to survive the rigors of the road. It's beautiful to look at. It's really well laid out and it feels solid underneath my fingers. If we look over here, this is the synth section. Now, if I grab this giant filter knob, I can sweep the filter with over a thousand increments so it's buttery smooth and just moves beautifully underneath my fingers. And then if we jump to the ADSR, so we've got real good synthesis control here. I can change the release, for example, really, really quickly, change the attack. Makes it really quick and easy. Then if I go to, for example, select another patch and over here on my left, we have the mixing section. So all those different layers that are in there, we can click quickly, select different zones, and then move these different layers in and out. Or with the zone buttons, quickly go over here and select a completely different sound. So if I go to electric piano, for example. So all those other layers are still there. But if I go back here, mix them in and out, turn other layers on, bring that electric piano in. Of course, these knobs here, I can assign anything to them. Panning, reverb, cutoff, filter, all that sort of stuff. Then we have the pad section here where we have it set up to play samples back. Or we can have it triggering drum rhythms or using it for selecting different modes when you're programming the actual synth inside Phantom. Wheels can be assigned to anything, whether it's cutoff or modulation or something a little bit more extreme, as can all of these knobs here. And of course, we have Roland's famous pitch bend modulation lever, as well as two assignable wheels. So these wheels can be assigned to anything, and it's really easy to do. You just hit shift, adjust the wheel, and it comes up with a parameter that you want. And you can quickly select a different parameter. I'm just going to assign it to cut off, and now it will do that. Very cool, very handy. Now let's talk about connectivity. Just take a look at the back of Phantom. It is full of holes to connect to absolutely everything you'll ever need. Balanced XLR stereo outputs, stereo outputs, plus two sub stereo outputs as well. So you can assign anything from click to different sounds, bass, etc., to different tracks on your mixer. We have an analog filter out, which I'll discuss in another video, plus two CV gate outs, so you can hook up your analog gear, your drum machines, and control them all from Phantom. Here you can connect up to four different pedals to control sustain, expression, filter, whatever you decide, as well as your standard MIDI in, out, and through, all on the back of Phantom, plus USB connectivity to your computer. Everything is there for expansion and control. So whether you're performing on stage or creating in the studio, Phantom has the professional connectivity and flexibility that you need.